Hey guys, I am currently at Serpent River Campground. We are here for one more night and then we are heading back to Nicholson Dam where Cam will be heading home after he drops us off as he does have to return to work. But then he'll be coming back up on the weekend to spend a couple days with us before we all return home. Slightly excited to get to my own bed and shower, but it has been very manageable living in this trailer for three weeks with two kids, a dog, Cam, and myself. It's been fun and I'll definitely write a couple posts, show some photos or videos of ways that we've kind of organized it to, to make it very workable for us over this time. Um, but yes, at Serpent River, it has been a very nice stay here. The owners are extremely nice and, and friendly. And in their front store, they have so many things. So if you need anything, pretty sure they'll have it uh, for the most part. It, there's a lot of things there. Um, even movie rentals, as we ended up renting one today because we expected it to really rain. Luckily, we haven't had any yet, so that's good. They have a pool here. It's warm. Um, it's not too deep. I can touch everywhere without going under. My mom can't. <laughs> Uh, but I am had a lot of fun swimming in it. It was a good way to cool down yesterday. I was it was extremely hot. Today we found a couple hikes that were in five minutes each way of the the campground that we did, and I'll post some photos of that in our in my blog. Those were really nice to see. There was a waterfall um, and a beautiful lake that we saw. And then on the campsite itself, the sites here, there's a few for overnight camping that are, have a gravel pad and then the remaining of it is grass. The gentleman was extremely nice and let my mom and I uh, park opposite ways so we were actually facing each other at this campsite. Makes it a lot easier instead of transporting things back and forth to each other's campsites. And it's just really nice, we're, we're right there um, and together. Uh, there's a lot of seasonal here, so there's a, a row around us, and then there's another section of seasonals. When you go over that section, there's a railroad crossing you do go over, and then you are where there's a few cabin sites and a few tent sites as well, and then some docks and a boat launch. The river feels warm. We never went in it, but like I said, it feels warm and it looks pretty clear. Yeah, so it was a nice last place to stop. It's nice because it is right on the main road. So if you are making a journey from west to east or east to west, this would be a really easy spot because you can literally just keep driving until you get here. It's not out of the way at all. The only then downside because it is right there is you do hear a lot of the traffic that goes on the road. Um, there is a lot of big transport trucks that do go on it um, even at nighttime. So it depends on, on how you are with that and, and how long you'd want to stay or what your, your plans are, if that would bother you or not. For us, it's been fine. I, I hear once in a while, but it just it becomes background noise anyways. Thanks for following us along and wait for our next post. Enjoy the video. Don't